Gottens came to Waltham as a result of a, a professor at Boston College, and they went into Garden Crest Apartments. So that's when I first met them, because they would come to my office all the time. We want you to come here, we want you to come here, we want you to do this. And so I got to really know them very well. And no matter what, this is what I found out. One, they're very loving people. <laughs> Two, they're hard working. Three, they know how to dress. <laughs> and they're very family oriented. So we're so blessed to have the Ugandans in Waltham. Now, because, yes, that's a good thing. We are blessed to have the Ugandans in Waltham. But because of the price of real estate in Massachusetts, it's very difficult for anybody to stay in Waltham. When people would come to me to do real estate, I treated them fairly. I didn't charge too much money. And that was rainmaking, so they kept coming back. So I think when you talk about investing in the city of Waltham, you are investing not only in your family, you're investing in the community. But the most important thing, you gotta get yourself a good broker that will work on what your needs are. Some people want all house, no yard, because they're busy. Other people want a yard. But when you connect with that broker, and you connect with the bank, that will be the success to finding any real estate in whatever community you want. I want to thank you for putting all this on. Because your future begins here. In the city of Waltham and in these types of, what you call, network. Um, what would you say has helped you remain relevant through all these cycles? Behave yourselves and believe in God. So I think that's the key to success. I've been mayor 20 years, you know what I mean? But I've been blessed to be mayor because I believe that it is a service, that you should have community service. We always encourage, we're trying to be, encourage the Uganda to become police officers, firefighters, school teachers. We want them working for the city of Waltham too.